What is going on, everyone? We are back with another music reaction. I'm Depraved. I'm Hellcat. And together we are... Hello, Depraved. Uh, so we had somebody randomly request, uh, within the last couple of months, uh, a Yo-Yo Honey Sing song. Uh, they didn't, I, I don't remember a specific one. I wasn't going to go through and sift through thousands I of comments to find it. I believe they just said, please do Yo-Yo Honey Sing. Yeah, so I decided to do this one. Uh, okay. Sounds it's his good. newest one. Sounds and I don't even me. know who Urvashi Rutella is. We'll find out. Uh, Universal Ratatouille. I don't. I don't know. Um, we will find out. Yes. And I, I'm not even going to begin to try to pronounce the actual name of the song. Vigdian Huron. Something like that. Uh, you did better than I would have. But uh, again, we're not super, super, super big on Yo Yo Honey Sing. Well, we don't mind. We enjoy him. him though. Yeah. Yeah. He's just not honestly depends on the track. Fast. Depends yeah. on the track. Yeah. All right. Uh, but yeah, I'm, I'm super excited to check this out. Give me one second. <sighs> Try to get that yawn out the way. All right. I just got a fork that song ago, guys. So, with that being said, this is uh, Yo-Yo Honey Sing with... Vivashi. Oh, you wanted the title. Vigdian Hiran? Yep. And in case we didn't... Did we do the I'm Depraved, You're Hellcat, Together yes. We're Depraved? I don't know. He's but... that tired. Yeah, guys. It's, it's been Let's a day. Let's get it. Let's get it. Love her hair. Bhai, isn't she your ex? What is she doing with that old model? Deni Penny and Love Dose Equari Fair. I'm sorry, what? Hmm? So she got a new sugar daddy? And he feels the need to go dose her. Give her a dose of him. I mean, the thing is, that's his ex. Right. Leave it alone, boy. But he's like, I could be, I could do better for her than uh, discount. Uh... You know what? It doesn't matter. It's your ex. What's? Leave it alone. Just... Listen, listen. Discount Sean Connery over here, okay? <clears throat> Wish. Wish Sean Connery. Same difference. I mean, again. Guys, it's your ex. Just remember why they're your ex. Maybe the hearts didn't break even. Okay, well, prepare to get your stepped on again then. Right. Even the track is saying no, 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 no. Okay, boys, what's with the high waters? It's easier to dance in them. Like, I'm sorry, but they're old, old man pants in it. Like, the pants are high-waisted. It's because he's in the old guys. Older guys. And he just called her a spoiled girl. That's the first thing he did. I'm just I... going to say, if you're going up to your ex and you're pushing her new sugar daddy away, probably not the way to start it. I am admittedly also curious as to how accurate the translation is. Right. Because he says something about broken bits, and I don't know exactly what that's supposed to represent other than maybe a broken heart. Yeah. Possible. But I was thinking of something completely... Different. Different. Right. Right. Healing their broken bits. I'm just saying. Right. <laughs> So far I have heard heathen and bitch several times. Several times. I'm saying whatever he is singing here is not flattering to his ex. 
So at the beginning, what did he mean that he's going to give her a love dose? This is kind of like a like hate comment section speech. And right. he knows she just wants a sugar daddy to spend money. So why did he get rid of the dude that was willing to do that? That's I, I'm, My, I'm very confused, guys. I'm more confused at the fact that like he's going everywhere she is in this place and him and his friends are dancing for her. They're kind of stalkerish, like it's creepy stalkers. Weird. Yeah, like, and they're doing the MJ kind of. I now want friends who just follow me around and, and dance with me when I start dancing. No, no, you're not dancing. She is sitting still, like a proper lady. No, no, no. I don't want to dance for other people. I just want my friends to follow me around, and whenever I start dancing, they start dancing too. I kind of feel like I wouldn't mind an entourage where I act perfectly solidly normal and like they don't exist but they they walk around singing sort of like a soundtrack for everything i'm doing and breaking into jazz hands and stuff i'd love to see the reactions of people in the mall right i'm just like walking along like yeah that, I, I, don't, I don't know what you're looking at and people are like yeah yeah you know spoiled bitch going shopping at walmart in the clearance section Right. I mean, it's a much more accurate portrayal than champagne and Gucci. True. For me. There you go. You're welcome. Sassy girl, classy, classy girl, lead a palm with two fancy, fancy girl. Don't you have to chori chori cold get the jori ten who cut a checker on a wall of messy, messy girl. Under a bawagi canavich, classy teddy party, a patalonic hitch. I'm gonna have to do the other town of Arino. Roll a gay kill only to me, Tandavich. On a pashatava, get te java. Gila jama, a moka java. Yafir tenu mona ke java. Na, 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 na. So this song really is just like following her around and telling her she kind of sucks. Oh, that she's a uh, spoiled. She take money. Yeah. Well, and I'm saying lady. she's a gold digger. Yeah, she's a trifling. Um, really but she kind of is. Uh, and she looks like she's just totally done with it. Yeah. Like she, this she's whole so time nice. she's she's looking at him like, yo. Like what the fuck? She's like we. <laughs> I'm bored. We're done. Why are you following me? Where's your money? If you're not paying, I'm not staying. That's right. just the way that it works. Uh, and, you know, it's so sad that she turned you into Romeo. I mean, like, what were you before? Play it? I mean, you're still here, so technically you didn't Romeo it up for her. Right. Just saying. It's the pants, dude. Kure ishk tamiza, mere kol kuch teri ane chiza. Give me dasa te nu dasa ta kalifa. Ethe mera koi na, ethe mera koi na. Muk gaya hu nari ja, tu tiyari nu bhi saal ho ya ti ja. Dil kare me nu zar koi ja. I'm really glad this is not one of the tracks that we were asked to do bad translations to. Right. I have heard a lot of crap in this that. Is not good. It's not good. Okay, so what was your woe over? Three years. It's been three years and you're still singing to her? It's been three years and now he's stalking her. I mean, that's what this counts as. Like, I do hope that like her I'm, sugar daddy presses charges. I, th I think I made it two years into us no longer living with my ex. Before, and I don't... I didn't even take that long. I knew like, no. It was like no. a couple months of not living with her for me to just stop thinking completely about her. Like, But like... It's not. It's not. What's wrong with you? I mean, like, what's wrong with all of you? <laughs> I can't. I can't. Okay. Keep going. It's very catchy, guys. Again, his voice is really nice, and it's a very catchy, well-put-together tune. But between what I am hearing... And what's being translated In terms us. of English words, which I'm sure aren't. It just sounds that way. And 
his very creepy tendencies with this chick. Granted, she's gorgeous, guys, but like... She's got some big old... Um, anyways. She's got some really nice thighs. Uh, I, and they're I, completely I exposed. Didn't even notice. Sure. Okay. Yeah, There's Romeo. Never mind, they belong together. That was the... That was the most awkward choreography I have seen in any of... Probably any of the Indian m music videos so far. Bollywood Why do I feel matter. like she got her choreography off of Britney Spears' recent knife dance? Uh, pretty much. That's pretty accurate. That's pretty, like, that was so bad, guys, I that and now I don't okay. care. Like, I now will. they they deserve each other. He's been thinking that he should drink poison this entire three years because she wanted somebody with more money. I, I don't know. I don't know. This want, is, like, I, they deserve each other. I want I'm you done. guys to understand, uh, as far as Jojo Honey Singh is concerned, I, I love his voice. He can sing. Yeah. Um, to be honest, he's not even a bad dancer. That choreography was shit. But yiked. whoever put that choreography together, especially hers. Hers was so awkward. That was awkward as hell. Um, like, it was barely on beat, and it was just awkward. And, like, I'm sorry. I will tell you guys this. Unless she was completely trashed on tequila and out with her girlfriends, no, no girl first. gonna dance no. like that. Yeah. No. Yeah. Wow. But then again, it's India. Maybe people break out in flash mobs. And... No, no. The ones that I've seen, that even in the like flash mobs that we've seen, have rhythm. Yeah. They, they learn a lot of styles of dancing growing up. I don't know what happened there. It's the choreography, 100%. I'm, I'm sure she's a lovely person. Not saying she's a gold digger. And I'm sure she's a great dancer. She's stunning. Something she tells to me lose this guy liked her dance. Well, yeah. I mean, I honestly, I preferred her walk. I would rather watch her walk, guys. Yep. Uh, yeah, I hate to see her go, but I love to watch her leave type thing. Um, Correct. I don't need to see whatever okay. whatever that travesty was at the end there. Okay. Yeah, no. Love you guys. Uh, it was an okay song, <laughs> though. Uh, I, I, Catchy. I there's just some things in the song that just baffle me. Like again, the whole three years thing really threw me off because I'm like, dude, what? Three years and well, you're still what? And look, like the entire song, like uh, okay, I take it back. Five sevenths of the song, he's insulting her, and then there's like the little part that's talking about how she made him into Romeo, that he's wanted to poison himself since then, that he misses her, blah blah blah. That's it. Romeo. But that's yep. all about him. That's nothing good about her. He doesn't add anything good about her. She's still... Yeah. Guys, I don't... I, I, I don't understand society. Yep. So anyways, that being said, thank you guys for hanging out with us. We're sorry if you really like that song. It's catchy. It's catchy. Sounds good. Mm-hmm. Um, but yeah, so we'll see you guys next time. Bye!